Hello, 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 and welcome, friends, to Story Time with Teacher Tippett. I'm Lady Long, and today I'm excited to share a fun story rhyme with you all. Are you ready? Let's get our book, and we'll get started. But first, let's put on our listening ears. Click, click. We're ready to listen to the words of the story. I have it here. Do you guys want to see it? <laughs> here it is. This is our story for the day. I'm going to read you guys this story and we'll see what's inside. I wonder what this story is going to be about. Before we get started, let's go over the parts of the book together. This is the front cover of the book. And if I flip it, whoop, this is the back cover. And this is the spine. The spine keeps the pages in the book. Yeah, if we didn't have the spine, the book would fall apart. How will we be able to read it then? So we take care of the spines of our book, friends. Let's find out the name of the book. Every book has a name. It's called the title. The title is the name of the book. The title is the name of the book. It's the name. It's the name. The title is the name of the book. Every book has a name. And the title of this book is Hey Diddle Diddle. That's super funny to say. And it rhymes too. Ooh. Let's look and see who's the author of this book. The author is Miss Melissa Everett. And the author is the person who writes the words. The author writes the words. The author writes the words. Hi ho the dairy ho. The author writes the words. There's also an illustrator. The illustrator is Miss Mary Manny. What does the illustrator do? The illustrator draws the pictures. The illustrator draws the pictures. The illustrator draws the pictures. Hi ho the Dario. The illustrator draws the pictures. <laughs> okay friends, we know all about the book. It's time now to read the story. Are you ready? Let's go. Okay, friends, now that we know the title, the author, and the illustrator of this book, let's open up the pages and see what's inside. Hey, Diddy Diddy, it's time to get silly like Mother Goose likes to do. We'll start with her voice, then make up our own. Maybe you can make up a verse too. Hey, diddle diddle, the cat and the fiddle, the cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such sport and the dish ran away with the spoon. Hey, diddle doodle, the boat and the poodle. The pineapple made a big fuss. The purple duck hoped to join the fun but was too busy driving the bus. <laughs> Hey, diddle daisy, now start to get crazy. The hippo can dance on her toes. The fridge flew a kite in a pink sky and the buffalo's hair is in bows. Hey, diddle Duncan, the goat and the pumpkin. The camel is taking a bath. The donkeys all have their swimsuits on and the cheetah is teaching them math. Hey, diddle donkey, the organ and monkey, the elephant sat on a stool. The penguin was glad to see her friends when she put jelly beans in the pool. <laughs> hey, dilly Dano, the goose and piano, the zebra stood on the flower. The clock and the horse danced in a line and an anteater sat in the shower.
Hey diddle dirtle, the moose in a girdle. The coconut wore one big shoe. The tiny giraffe started to laugh when the porcupine painted him blue. Hey diddle dunny, did you find it funny? This nonsensical book of rhyme? I hope when you're done, you ask for more. I will read it to you any time. <laughs> the end. Wow, hey diddle diddle. That was such a funny, silly story. I loved all the silly little pictures and I especially loved all the rhymes. What did you guys like, friends? <laughs> what was your favorite part of the story? Leave a comment down below and let me know what was your favorite part of the book, Hey Diddle Diddle, by Mary Everett. That's the end of our story, friends. I'd like to say if you or your grown-up has a book that you'd love me to share, leave it down in the comments below. I especially love to share new books by new and upcoming authors. Please be sure to leave the name of the book you'd like me to read as well as the name of the author. Well, I'll see you next time, friends, for story time, of course. Bye-bye and happy learning.